so recently a volcano erupted in St. Vincent. <laughs> la, 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 la volcano name. La, 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 la Sophia. La Sophia. Am I pronouncing the shit right? Well, anyways, yes, a volcano has erupted and, and, and it has destabilized the country, to say the least. But I think there is a way that you can bounce back from this, because we know, you know, volcanic ash mm, makes amazing fertilizer and can be used in skincare too. So, yeah, this could be a way to bounce back from that setback. But we're not even going to get into all of that. We're going to get into the fact that somebody actually climbed this erupting volcano, this upset volcano that is spewing its guts out. Somebody actually climbed the volcano to vlog. Meanwhile, people are running to get away from it. These two wise guys that I've seen in a video floating around on the internet decided to, you know, I think now would be a great time to go hiking. Um, let, let me show you a piece of the video right here. was literally out here trying to get a Darwin's award Man, yeah, that, that's basically what it was I think he has given up on life because nobody in their right mind would even attempt to climb a freaking active volcano it's like he had a, a, a senku from Dr. Stone like he had a senku moment but instead of but instead of this moment being about the progression of mankind from the Stone Age, it, it, it can only be described as one of the most idiotic things I have seen happen since the beginning of 2021. What was his thought process in going up this volcano? And it said he's a tour guide, you know. I wonder what kind of tour him guiding. He couldn't care me good no. In an extract from the Gleaner, a scientist was saying, Dr. Richard Robertson, said it's absolutely foolish. It is absolutely dotish to do that. People talk about bravery, and to me, somebody is brave when you are aware of the risk that you're putting yourself through because of some positive job or they need to contribute to, to society in a fundamental way and you still take the action to save your family or something like that. Robertson told the listeners to the state-owned NBC radio. You are aware of the risk. You know you could be killed or you know you could be hurt, but you still do it. That's a brave person. A brave person is not somebody who goes up to the mountain putting themselves and their parties at risk and the people who might have to rescue them. The volcanologist added, I didn't even know that was a profession. Anyway, if you have watched the video to this point, I ask that you please subscribe, like, drop a comment. You know, no nah, pressure nobody still in but I mean it not cost you nothing. Yeah, just a way of supporting me. Yeah, you know? Yeah, so if you like what I'm doing, just drop a like or a comment. Yes, my unfiltered opinion. Yeah, peace out.